Oh my god, wait, 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 wait. Hey there, Glow Toads and Jelly Tarfs, it's Moscow bringing you another video. Today we are going to be reacting to Dragon Prince, Season 2, Episode 2, Half Moon Lies. Last episode felt very forgettable. It was very much a set up episode into this season. I remember that they were teaching Zim to fly and I think Callum was trying to learn some magic off of that elf. We got a little bit of the history about the place and that it had been destroyed so no humans could gain access to it. Callum still can't really do magic yet. Really Oh, she got like, I thought she was tired, but she wasn't. She got like, she got like drugged or something, right? And it was Soren and Claudia, not Cassandra. Although part of me is now tempted to keep calling her Cassandra because part of me thinks it'd be really fucking funny, but I won't. I'll try to remember that she's called Claudia. As usual, thumbs up video, click subscribe to join me on this journey if you want access to the full, raw, early, uncut version of these reactions, as well as two episodes ahead. Click the link in the video description down below. It will take you to my Patreon. And don't don't forget to leave me your fake spoilers down in the comment section down below. I love those fake spoilers. But that is enough fanning around, so here it is, and we're going to click play and get started. Let's go. Yeah, Daddy will be proud of you. Soren's not going to kill them. He's just not. It's not in his blood to do that. Yeah, it was. Oh, she didn't get drugged. She got. There was a flu. It was making her really sleepy and tired. That was it. That was it. Why the rose? Do it. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Yeah, he's not gonna. He's just not. Somebody's either gonna stop him or something's gonna happen. Just never attacked someone who's sleeping before. Yeah, it doesn't seem it's valid. Sporting. <laughs> do you want me to wake her? No. And yes. How long do you need her to be awake for it to be sporting? Ten seconds. Five. One second. Okay. <laughs> On three. One. Two. Three. Ah, there we go. Okay. How did you resist a sleep spell? Hard to sleep with a thorn poking at you. Nice. Oh, that was why she went for the rose. Excellent. Well done. <laughs> I dislike how much of myself I see in this character. I just really dislike. Like, I don't need to be called out. I don't need to be called out. I just don't. You need to stop doing that. Oh, nice. He's pretty good. Okay, this is better. This is better. This is quite cool, actually. I wouldn't be throwing my weapons. Oh well, never mind, never mind. She's got the dexterity for it. Ooh, let's go, Rayla. Let's fucking go. Yes. I keep telling people, sweep the leg is not a thing in sword fighting. <laughs> there you go. More sword fighting lessons. I'm eager to learn. Any last words? Elf. There's two against one. That's not fair. Might count as a word. What do you mean? <laughs> Well, if you've got to, you've got to. Callum? Don't fight each other. You're not enemies. Your friends tried to kill you. She threw mud in my face. <laughs> she, she threw a mud in my face out of all the things. That is by far the worst. Soren, you're such I really like Soren. And some gun in my mouth. <laughs> okay, okay. Knock it off a second. Just let me explain. Let's Herself, talk. But a good elf. What do you mean, but a good elf? She kidnapped. <laughs> okay, the Scottish accent there was quite good. I'm not gonna, but a good elf. That was actually exactly how I would have probably said that. I don't know if she's just getting better or if I'm just endearingly warming up to the accent now. I can't tell. Yeah, there they are. That was very confident, Callum. Oh, yeah? Uh, oh, I guess. Cute. <laughs> Even though your hair's a little messy. Yeah, his hair was a little messy. <laughs> Oh my god, wait, am I gonna start shipping these two? That would be fucking interesting. That would be interesting, because these are like two of my favorite characters on the opposite sides. So that would be very interesting. Dudes are very alike in certain aspects. Who are you trying to impress anyway? Claudia? <laughs> yes, the answer to that would be a resounding yes. Wow! 
Wow, Callum, calm the fuck down, bro. Figured out what's going on. Wow. Why the prince is down bad. So there is no egg. What? What happened to the egg? It You'll hatched. understand in a second. There it is. <laughs> yeah, valid, Claudia, valid. Okay, okay, not the reaction I was expecting. Uh, totally justified, but not the reaction I was expecting. I thought Claudia would be a bit more angry and upset just given, you know, how strict her father is with things. It's like us when we first saw King in the Owl House. Because the King, your dad, really misses you. <sighs> Soren! Oh my- Soren! I mean like it's a good idea, it was fucking terrible execution but it was a good idea but we know that Rila, that's why the recap is telling us about the king and stuff like that because Rila is actually gonna have to come clean. Oh dear, this is gonna be a difficult conversation. You squash innocent creatures to make magic pancakes. True. Valid. Look, I, tried it your way. I love how like morally ambiguous and morally grey the two of these are. It really throws me for a loop because it means that their characters could go in any direction. I still think with the way that the show is presenting Claudia in other ways other than just her personality that she's going to turn dark. Whereas Soren could go either way because just like, even just his armour is telling me that. Because, well, you have to tell him. <laughs> the way Callum's face lights up and realizes not having it. Are you two like? Did I interrupt something between you and what? Me and Rayla? No, I don't think of her that way. I think of her more as an assassin, an as a, an, an assassin friend. Oh, an yeah, assassin yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I have friends like that. So, uh, you wanted to talk? Yes. I so, is this going to be an actual canon ship? These two. Hmm, I don't know. And I don't even know how I would feel about it if it did. I like the idea of Callum having this crush and being, I guess, in some way easily manipulated by Claudia because if Claudia is going to go down a dark route, there's a lot of really interesting and nuanced things that you could do there between their relationship and with her as a character to explore. But if they do get together... I'd be very disappointed if the show made it that they got together and Claudia ended up becoming good. I think with the way that it's all presenting, she has to become bad. She just does. I don't know. It just... I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. make up for it, but I thought maybe you'd let me show you around all the magic moon places and stuff. Oh, I no. would let you. No, don't, 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 don't. Wait, the elf told you that stuff in confidence. The last thing we need are the humans getting their eye hands on it. If there's an accident because he's doing something dangerous and stupid, well, that's on him. Oh, God, wait a minute, what if Claudia ends up becoming the good guy and it's Soren that turns evil? I don't like it, I don't like it. I am real. Huh, that's exactly what an illusion would say. Uh, but Claudia is... And just like that, she disappears. <laughs> Listen, it's not what you think. I dislike the fact that I really like Claudia. Uh, no, we shouldn't really be showing her this. Like, she's into dark magic and stuff. Like, this is dangerous. Oh, my kind of magic? Yeah, dark magic. Dark magic. Do you always whisper when you're being judgmental? <laughs> I, I, I love do you always whisper when you're being judgmental? I love that script. Humans weren't born with magic. We were born with nothing, but we still found a way to do amazing things. That's what dark magic is really all about. Mm. Don't do it, Callum. I'm Don't sorry, do it. It's just not for me. Mm. Fear. Good for you, Callum. Stick it by your morals. Good for you. Zim is nervous. Aww. I'll show you. It's fine. <laughs> that does look like a lot of fun, though. But also very dangerous. Is this where Zim's gonna learn to fly? That was the best! Yeah! Ugh. Ooh, at least he passed that bit. 
Okay, so it didn't break. I see what he's doing. Like, do it the first time, make it safe. Do it the second time, horrible accident. Fuck. Zim's gonna have to learn to fly fast, but I don't know if Zim will even be able to hold his own weight up, let alone his weight and Ezrin's. Your eyes aren't closed. Oh. And she knows that she can manipulate that. And she knows that she can manipulate that. Wait until you see the moon, I really like her as a character. Actually, hold on. We should come back. I like I like and dislike her. It's very conflicting. <laughs> Same with Thorin. He's very conflicting. Oh yes. Real love, well done. What you thinking about? Unless you think it's not safe for some reason. I love her. <laughs> I love her. I wasn't even sure how this was gonna go, like what was gonna happen here. I thought I thought that he was gonna like he was gonna do it and then Zim would have to fly. I didn't expect Rayla to be keeping an eye on everything and jump down just just at the right moment. Yep, yep, she's a cool character. She I get I get the hype. I get the hype. The hype is justifiable. Yeah, because now you're going. Yeah, you went on it the first time, come on in. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, she's not trusting this at all. She could have she could have cut the line there for you, buddy. Just like she could have. But then he tightened it. Callum, I know I'm not explaining it well, but you just have to look me in the eyes and trust me. Trust her. I can see you believe it. But I've known Soren and Claudia for years. You and I don't have that again. Ugh. Not yet, but she's telling the truth, Callum. I know it's hard, because it'd be hard to... People that you'd known your whole life, yeah. Fuck, that is difficult. She should talk... She's gonna have to tell them about the dad. She's gonna have to hey, tell them about the dad. something different with your hair? Some kind of a braid bag, flowers? You're thing? such a yeah, guy. so what? Having fun. Uh, you built a zip line today. I took no joy in that. Yeah, right. Bill shittery. Bill fucking shittery. This is so pretty. Blue James, I need your help. If wisdom is what you seek, I shall do my best to fake it. <laughs> <laughs> That's so fucking relatable. If wisdom is what you seek, I will do my best to fake it. That's great. That's fucking great. Don't I have to stop hiding the truth. No. Real trust is about accepting even the dark parts we will never know. Strong relationships need honesty. The full truth. <laughs> oh, now you sound like my first three husbands. <laughs> I'm afraid of hurting him, but I owe him. Well, now we know why you, you why it's three if you've been keeping secrets and stuff. I like, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm all for like not giving absolutely every part of yourself away to people. Let's them in too close. But I do think there is something to be said, especially for strong partnerships and stuff, that you do be honest. And actually, sometimes speaking to your friends and being honest with your friends is easier than honesty with anybody else. So yeah. All right, you creepy bastard. Be putting that in my eye. Nothing. 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 Oh, you're powerless. Useless. I thought you were going to be something special. Is he talking to the mirror or himself? Ah. Uh, caught that. Oh, is it going to be something to do with fire? That was cool. That was fucking cool. Oh, here it is. What is this? Yes, what is that? Looks like an elf study or like office or something. Hmm. Hey, did you just have your hand shadow hold my hand shadow? That's cute. <laughs> I hate it. 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 <laughs> Ah. So, Claudia, 
Yeah. Not Cassandra. I've known you. If she turns evil, I'm going to start calling her Cassandra. Cassandra, like, because Claudia, like, now is, like, a character that I really, really like. There's so many layers to her character and stuff, and I really like it. I like the stuff she does. I doesn't, I don't like some of the stuff she does. Like, I like and I dislike her. This is Claudia. If she starts turning, she's getting called Cassandra. Long. Yeah, me too. Well, sure, you've known yourself your whole life. <laughs> The you romantic in me is dying. You make me laugh too. And you make me think. Without words. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god, wait, 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 wait. Don't, 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 don't. Wait. Callum, I need to tell you something. Thank you for that. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I did not, like, don't get me wrong, like, Callum isn't, like, my most favourite character in the show. He's definitely kind of at the bottom of the list. He's just your average kind of protagonist. But I don't dislike him enough to want his first fucking kiss to be a lie. Not a lie. I'm not saying that Claudia doesn't like him. I'm saying that, like, in the current situation where she's trying to kind of take advantage of him for her own means is not the right time to kiss somebody. It's really just not. We need to talk. Yeah. I know what happened. Claudia told him about his dad. He's oh no. Oh. <sighs> Dang, Claudia. Dang. Like, I respect the honesty. Wow, there was actually a lot in that episode when you really boil it down, like the illusionist elf, I know we got her name like three times in this episode, but I'm really bad with names, but like she was talking about like that half that we keep hidden, and then Rayla was saying, you know, you have to be fully honest and not keep secrets and blah 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 blah, and then Claudia did just that with him, but we still didn't get the story, we still don't know how it happened. That's bugging me. I would have thought maybe by the end of season two we would have our answers to that. Unless they're gonna really drag it out for the rest of the show and then not reveal it until like the very, very, very end of the show. I don't know. Ugh, everything is pointing towards Claudia becoming Cassandra. Everything is pointing towards it and I'm not really sure which way I want it to go because there's a lot of interesting things you could do with her character in that sort of situation. There's so many interesting directions that you could take that. I'm surprised that these reactions don't do as well. Like, there's a lot in this show, and yet the reactions for both me and Elijah don't really do that well, which is really surprising considering how good the show is. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's got its flaws, and I've certainly been pointing them out along the way. Like, it's lack of giving us full concrete information. But yeah, like, for the most part, it's really good, and there's a lot of really good characters in it. And it did really well on both of our polls, and we're like, so how the fuck is it not doing well on YouTube? Either way, though, I'm really enjoying the show so hopefully you guys are as well don't forget to thumbs up video click subscribe and leave me your fake spoilers down in the comment section down below if you want access to the full 38 minute long version of this reaction you can click the link in the video description down below it will take you to my patreon where i'm also usually like two episodes ahead but that's all i've got time for i'll see you next time with another video and until then haste you back guys